Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's Ivan Steph, and you guys, things are about to get real dark. So I've talked about a lot of creepy people on my channel in the past. A 44-year-old man who married a 16-year-old girl that he's known since a child. A TikToker who constantly kisses his little sister on camera and touches her in places which shouldn't be touched. But I recently came across these two TikTokers, which definitely tops this list. Their names are Naniva and Nareem. And they might seem like a cute couple at first, until you realize they're siblings. Yeah, you heard me, like as in brother and sister. And I'm not joking about this. According to Famous Birthdays and even their own YouTube channel, they're siblings. Naniva's Instagram page, it's filled with absolute madness. On her page, she has reposts of her TikToks, which consists of the two kissing, Nareem touching her in places which shouldn't be touched, Nareem exposing his disgusting peaches, and then stuff like this. This this is disgusting. Don't get me wrong, I understand culture and how some show more love to their family than others, but this, this isn't it. This is literally for the purpose of keeping it ad friendly, insect. I am honestly in shock because this type of content is readily available for anyone to see online and I am just surprised that it's allowed to be posted. It goes against the TikTok guidelines. In the video, the girl is 16 and a minor. Oh yeah, and let's not forget, their brother and sister. So there's this one TikTok I found of the two together where they kiss. And I mean, well, there's a lot of TikToks of the two kissing, but this one in particular is really scary. So obviously the kissing part is gross itself, but what makes this video even more disgusting and disturbing is the song they're singing to while they're doing this. The song is called Secreto, and I found a translated version of it online on billboard.com. And just take a look at some of these lyrics. We're just friends to the world and we do it privately. And I'm alone in my bed. God is the witness. And no one will ever find out that you are my woman. And no one wants to see us together. What we have is a secret, but we always see each other. And the whole world talks about us, but we always have sex. Honestly, the lyrics accompany with what they're doing in the TikTok just makes this terrifying. The fact that they know what they're doing is wrong, but they continue to do it anyway. It's just sad. So these two have a YouTube channel and it's called Naniva and Nareem. And I was watching a couple of their videos because I was curious to what type of content they post on there. And it's even scarier. So three years ago, they uploaded a siblings tag video. So I don't really understand what's going on because I don't speak Spanish, but they're putting whipped cream on each other and it does seem funny at first, but then things escalate. Adios! <laughs> Wow, I'm just lost for words. I understand play fighting, but what we just witnessed, that's way too much. That's abuse. By no means is Nareem a bodybuilder or anything, but regardless, he still does have some decent muscle. And Naniva on the other hand, I mean, look at the girl. She's built like a twig. She probably weighs like 100 pounds, and the fact that he kicked her that hard when she wasn't even facing him and laughed after, <laughs> That's messed up. So after this, I took a look at some of their other videos and their recent one was from seven months ago and it translates to what do our kisses taste like? And this video, just a heads up, it's absolutely disgusting. Like I know that the others were gross, but what you're about to witness, it takes it to an entire new level. So basically what the video is, is they blindfold the other person, find some type of food, put it on their lips, and then kiss them. Gross, I know. So there's this one part of the video where the girl looks really uncomfortable doing this, and at one point she's even holding the brother's hands and resisting him. Then as soon as she lets go, this happens. No, mama. Mama, <laughs> and a few seconds after that, This, this is messed up. Look, as much as I hate all this, I truly hope that it is consensual and that, you know, Neneva isn't being forced to do this. But the amount of aggressiveness that is in this video is just frightening and very uncomfortable to watch. And it just makes you wonder that if they're going this extreme on camera, Imagine what goes down off camera. So later on in that video, it gets even more extreme where Nareen tries to lick Naniva's toe. Yeah, you heard me. <laughs> Despite her yelling, <laughs> pushing him away and repeatedly slapping him, 
he still does it. And the video gets even worse, but for the sake of not permanently blinding and scarring all of my viewers, I'm not gonna show it. This is just so messed up. And the fact that most of the people who watch the videos are probably kids, it terrifies me. Because this type of content is only encouraging children to act this creepy, perverted, disgusting way. And I had some of the comments translated and judging by those and the like ratio, I can't believe that this type of content is normalized. I can't believe that their fans are so blinded and can't see the real issue here. Honestly, ByteDance and YouTube need to do a better job at monitoring their content. And I know it's hard because there's thousands and thousands of videos a day which get uploaded on their platform which shouldn't be there. But honestly, it took me five seconds to realize what was going down and you know that they're related to each other it's just disgusting an app made for dancing and lip syncing to viral songs making memes and just having a laugh has turned to this anyway guys that's gonna do it for this video honestly i, I have no other words to say like, i could go on and on but for the sake of my well-being and your well-being I don't wanna watch any more of their videos. If y'all can leave a like on this video and subscribe if you haven't already, it really would mean a lot. I'm about to hit 50,000 subscribers and it truly would mean a lot to me. If you have any suggestions on other creepy TikTokers or really just people who shouldn't be on social media, leave a comment down below and I'll try to cover it in a future video. Also make sure to follow me on my social media. My TikTok is Ivan Steph Official. And yes, I do have TikTok, you know, despite me ranting about the app, I, I enjoy using it. I just want to see better for the app. That's why I make these types of videos. My Instagram is Ivan Steph Official. My Twitter is Ivan Steph. And my Snapchat is Shotgun underscore U09. But anyway, guys, that's officially going to do it for this video. And until next time, it's been Ivan Steph. Peace.